What is up guys? This is Xinstructor for Xinstructor.com doing a video review, movie review for Suicide Squad. Um, the first thing I gotta say is go watch the movie. Don't believe any other video reviews, any other uh, bad reviews online, uh, aka Rotten Tomatoes, uh, Rolling Stone. Um, this is definitely not worse than Fantastic Four. Not worse than the recently released Ghostbusters movie. <laughs> Definitely a must watch. Although there's a couple things wrong with the movie. It's just minor things and uh, I believe DC is going in the right direction. Uh, Margaret Robbie as Harley Quinn is perfect. Uh, she fits the role. She's awesome. She nails Harley Quinn. Uh, also Deadshot, Will Smith. Uh, you know, typical Will Smith bringing it on. Uh, the movie is mainly focused on those two characters. Uh, it, there's a lot of a lot of focus on them too. Um, even though uh, each Suicide Squad member does get an introduction at the beginning, um, uh, they're the ones that get all the attention, and uh, it's not a bad thing. Definitely, not. it just opens up the gate uh, for future movies. And Jared Leto, you know, also uh, a different Joker that we've never seen before. Uh, portraying this mafia gangster boss uh, Joker that uh, it just leaves us wanting more uh, because he was only in the movie for about eight minutes um, also uh, what we saw from him I thought was good uh, Batman is also just very minimal role in the movie as well which is also welcome um, uh, but we do get an insight on Harley Quinn's backstory and Deadshot just a little bit. Um, uh, it just leaves us wanting more. Uh, the villain, although I didn't like it, uh, there's a couple things I would change. And I'm trying to keep this spoiler free just in case if you guys are trying to watch it. And uh, I'll probably make another video review. But uh, as far as uh, uh, ratings go, from 1 to 10, I'll give it an 8 out of 10. Definitely a must watch. Go check it out, guys like comment subscribe peace